now we will create ice tracker dot java okay and this class will be the base this class will extend tracker class of google cloud vision api okay so i'll create this ice tracker again i'll right click java class okay i'll create i'm creating a new class His name is ice tracker okay and this will extend tracker and if i'm not wrong yeah this is how it will be done right now what i'm going to do is i'm going to copy this and paste it in my into studio so here here i'll explain how we can do it first of all i need to i need to improve import everything so okay this is what we have done we have first set the threshold okay and i need a context this is my public constructor that i'll use which i'll use to call this class okay here is the method that i'll overwrite and this method will be used to update tracking data so here i am getting face object okay so if my left eyes is open more than the threshold and if my right eyes is open more than the threshold then i'll say that my that open eyes are detected if this condition is not true then i'll say that close eyes are detected okay and i'll get another method whose, whose name is on missing okay this method is called when no face is detected in this case i'll say that no face is been detected okay both all three of this condition will invoke method update man view which will be available in my main activity dot java okay so now this is the tracker class that i'll use okay now let's go back to the article here you can find a face tracker face tracker uh, demon so what this demon is going to do as uh, doing for us it will uh, create a uh, uh what i can say a multi processor factory so this factory will be responsible for setting this tracker as our uh, as our base for detection of eyes so i'll create this face tracker demo similarly uh, you have to right click on this new and java class and put the name now you have to extend as shown here multi processor factory and this will also and here also we will overwrite some of the methods so this method will have i'm just going to copy and paste this okay and just import the things for which android studio is asking okay so i have written ice tracker which was created here okay so in this way sorry one more thing it, since it is an interface i i cannot extend it i i can only implement it so i'll do implement okay so this demon is responsible for setting my ice tracker as base for detection of ice don't get confused in this i'll just show you how you can do that so now our work for detection has been done okay now i want to uh, i want to use this ice tracker i want to use this ice tracker and this uh, face tracker demo in my android applications for that i'll go to my main activity and i'll perform some of the things